What's going on, guys? Delta 4 is signing in. And in this one, I'm bringing you my Black Ops 2 Zombies Origins staff guide. Now, by Harmony, I actually mean the song. If you listen, there's a higher part that's harmonious. In it. Alright, so let's just jump into the video. Uh, I'd start in the spawn room because I want to show you how to get where I went. Now, it could be on the other side, but it happened to be on Gen 2 whenever I did it, but this is kind of like if you don't know the map that well, but uh, in this video, I kind of like needed you to uh, understand a bit. But anyway, Robot's Foot, there should be lights on one of the feet. So if you shoot it, it'll open up and let it step on you, and then you can get the one step part. But if there, are, uh, if there are two or more robots coming, then only one of the feet will have lights on. But anyway, this is how you get the ice disc or the blue disc. Or if you got Zombie Chronicles whenever it first came out, it'd be the water. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but anyway, so as you can see there, uh, I just showed you two spots whenever it did the little circle thing. But this is where they actually pick it up. And by the way, this song is kind of like going to be my new song. Because I thought it was pretty good, so I'm just going to like use it in a lot of videos. It is going to be in another video I'm making. But it was actually going to be its first appearance, but then it wasn't. But anyway, uh, round eight. Uh, this is when the pans respond. I was playing with one random dude when this game started, and then he ended up quitting because he was lost. And so it made it easier to do everything that I ended up doing in this video. But anyway, he gets down, like, I don't even know what the heck he was doing there. He gets down. I literally just spawned in. And behind me, I mean, the hands are spawned. So, uh, I really just ran him around the map a couple times to get him, uh, killed. But I had to buy the MP40. Uh... So right here, I just attached to him so that, you know, you can just see uh, how I did it. So I just ran around the footsteps, uh, went over here and bought the MP40. Uh, so I really just started running around, taking him around the map, uh, made him jump down here. Really slows him down, gets you to connect with the zombies more. Uh, this has nothing to do with the staff, but anyway, so here's a good way to get the fans killed. I saw the robot coming and I was like, perfect. So I run up there, and I'm safe, and So as I'm waiting for the robot to step up, I'm making, making sure there's none behind me, and the panzer is just sitting on the ground, and you can't do anything. So you have to shoot off the mask, and then you'll be able to kill him. So once I saw his mask, his face guard explode, uh, I was like, alright, I'll just run away now, just in case the zombies be spawning. So the Panzer is actually essential to building all of the staffs because it helped with one of the staffs and build all the staffs you So anyway, I got pretty lucky here. I decided to dig and I happened to get this hoppy blood so no one could see me. And I just ran right over here to where his face. Don't shoot him in the back. It's the dumbest thing ever. So I just. Oh, I, thought, I thought he was in there and then aim assist and he goes on. Boom. As soon as he blows up, you can pick up a fire, uh, the fire staff part. And some of the parts, like, you can't actually see the, like, the legit part, you can only see the glow in theater mode. Like, you couldn't see the ice disc. But anyway, there's the glow, which means that it was there. So wherever you kill the panzer, it'll drop in there. Sometimes if you kill the panzer in the right spot, the part will be, like, floating and you have to, like, jump. And I'm, not, I'm sorry if you get, uh, glitched or anything. But anyway, you just had to get ice staff parts. Uh, this is a little dig spot. It's just, like, a bunch of bone skeleton, skull and some mud, I believe. So, uh, as you can see, there are little white specks, meaning it's snowing, so you walk up to it, press, uh, action button, and if, if there's a little delay, whenever you see the little, uh, mud come up, and there's the delay, then that means that there's gonna be, uh, a part. So as you can see here, I continue running up, and, uh, actually, so, see, look, there's a little delay. But whenever you go to get ice parts, as you can see, there are three uh, parts. There are three parts of the staff, and each part corresponds to a part of the map. So the top part of the staff, 
have to go up uh, to the entrance of the church and cat and up till Gen 6. The bottom part, you have to be anywhere that is not past, anywhere that is not past No Man's Land. You have to be either in Workshop, which like is the part that branches out to Generator 2 and 3, you have to be below that. And then the middle is just anything between the church and the workshop, basically. So, uh, I just showed you where the fire parts were. It's right here, it's by those boxes, right there, that was right there. And then it's also by those fiery benches. And as soon as you finish the generator, boom, the uh, fire pops up. And it's only if you do the sixth, you don't have to do all of them. Uh, anyway, I drop down here to the bottom of the map so that I can go get the last part of the ice staff. And here's the dig spot. And actually, the more you dig, even if it's not snowing, or you've already picked up a part, even on a snow round, if it's a snow round and you haven't picked them all up, but you've picked up like the middle one, if you start digging in the middle anyway, you'll actually have a better chance of uh, picking up first try on the bottom or the top. Like, it, it's just kind of the more you dig, you know, the more chance you have of picking up. But anyway, you open up here, and there's this black record that's actually right there in the middle. So, a black record, that's what people call it. I mean, I shouldn't be saying discs, or should be saying records. No way, if I could get out of here, oh my goodness. So right down here, it's in the wheelbarrow that I just showed you. When you open it up, it can also be right here. You'll have to walk all the way up to it and then grab it. And the other one is right at the stairs. Like, when you get to the stairs that go up to the top of the excavation site, there's this little, I mean, some people, I've heard someone say generator, but it'll just be sitting on that little crate box thing. And you can pick it up. And this thing helps you open up the bottom of the excavation site. So I decided, because I literally never pack up the on this map. Uh, so I decided to pack a bunch of tops because it just looks sick as crap. <laughs> so anyway, I picked up a Max Strong part here actually, and I picked up the gramophone right there. It's actually just in that corner right there, but you can't see. And it could also be there, and I think those are the only two spots, but it could also be like... I don't know. I accidentally pressed the record button right here, and I had to get rid of it. But, uh, I think that the gramophone can only be right there, but I'm not sure. There might be a third spot, but it's always going to be down here. So no, it's going to be there. I don't think it can spawn on the table, but anyway, since you have the, you have to have the black record to put it on the table, put it on the table, uh, that will open up, and like this all, this all will happen, just play a little ring around Rosie, and then grab the gramophone because you need it, like you can just tell so here, I grab it, boom, start running up the stairs, and you actually could see it there. I guess you can see the ground pump. Anyway, you have to go up the church, go to Gen 6, and I ended up messing up here. I decided to get one of the wind staff parts, and I got the zombie kill because I don't even know what my strategy was. It was, it was terrible. Uh, right here, run up, shoot it, and I honestly didn't even think I was in the wind staff, but apparently I was grabbed the part. Uh, ran out because the new round was starting. Uh, it, actually, I had to go stop the generator 4 from being taken down. Because 4 is my homie. I mean, that's where Jug is. I, I never ended up needing it. But, like, 4, I'm just... I love you, bud. So anyway, reload, get back to home. So then I ran away, just, uh, mowed down the zombies because I needed to get the round to a, a, minimum, a minimum amount of zombies. So I got an insta-kill and started shooting all, like, there was all one side, so I just shot all of them up. So go up to church, go to this tunnel, this is the ice tunnel, put the gramophone down, make sure that you have the blue slash ice record. So once you do, uh, access the teleporter when you finally get there. Now see, this thing is open. The only reason that that two little pedestal thing was open that had the blue gym. The only reason that was open was because I went through the ice tunnel. That's the only reason. So now the middle was open and I thought that was pretty convenient. Uh, actually right here I used my little, 
I used my glasses. If I didn't have my glasses, I might not have seen it. But boom. When I played it, I could actually tell that it was yellow. So I shot it open. Sorry, that was blurry. So boom, shot it open. Bah. I was in reload, wrapped apart, and you know. So, uh, I'm going to show you where the wind slash yellow record is, I believe. I'll walk past here. Yes, I am. But just just before we get into that, I want you guys to know that when you go through a certain tunnel, okay, so it can be right here. It can be at those boxes, it'll just be sitting there. It can be on this little bench, laying on the bottles, or it can be on this broken wall. Like, it'll just be leaning right in that wall. But anyway, when you go through a specific tunnel, that will only open up the, the gym. If you go through the wind tunnel, it will open up the land. Anyway, so go down to the bottom of the exploration site. You should have opened it up around there with the black record. Go to the ice because you have all three parts plus the gym. You have to have three parts plus the gym. So I pick it up. Uh, if you take the ice, uh, you have to get the ice tunnel, then the ice one will open. Whichever one you go through, that one will open. So you can't expect to go through the fire and pick up the wind. But anyway, right there, it was actually the lightning or purple record. And the reason I'm saying like everything I can think of is because I'm very judgmental, but anyway, it can be right there. And I actually failed to show you where all the other parts were. I'm really sorry about that, but let me just try to show you with my words. So, by Juggernaut. There's a Wonder Fizz, and next to the Wonder Fizz is a table, and it's on the table. And then, just to the right of Generator 4, where Juggernaut is, right here, boom. If you go left a little bit, there's that wagon over there. Uh, on the wagon, there will be the lightning staff record that you should see. But I I'm sorry that I failed to show that, but anyway, I went down here, I had all three parts of the wind, plus the uh, gym. So I built it, traded it for the ice staff, because the only way to get multiple uh, staffs are to do a glitch. And I actually think it requires getting three of the upgrade. But anyway, uh, as you can see here, there's this flaming, or uh, there's this orange flame. I'm telling you, it's orange. The fire staff is not red. If you see red, it is colorblind, people. Alright. Anyway, it's, it's orange, alright? Now. As you can see, uh, it's gonna come up. There's that that plane right there. You can't miss it. Right there. I mean, you can, I guess. But it's glowing orange. It's got this little ball. It's kind of like a little circle. Uh, you can't really see here, but boom, you see a little explosion, and then it's coming down. So uh, I tried to get the right shot at this, but no matter how you shoot it, when you shoot it where you shoot it, really. But anyway, I backed up a bit for you so that you can see the full uh, grabbing. So you see it boom, boom, blows up. You see that little, you see the staff part, that's the staff part, boom. Goes right between the two footsteps and the middle, the two middle footsteps. But anyway, you have to go grab it. So I grabbed the Max's drone part, uh, yeah, so I go on the reverse, and this is actually where I start getting the lightning staff. Now, I actually don't have footage of the fire or the lightning staff being built. I only have the ice and the wind, but however, you should be able to build them uh, from the footage I already have and how I explain it. Because all four staffs, they're all built the same way. You get the three parts, you get the stone, or the gym, and the, the, every time you get the gym, alright, you get on the tank, and this is the first part. As you can see, there's this little, I don't know, tower, little, probably for people to be able to look out. Anyway, I almost got stepped on there actually, but then you just run past that. And so, uh, I just drop down because I want to stay in this part of the map. I won't have to walk around T3. And go through here, down the tank station, and this is where the tank actually stopped. 
so you'll have to wait. And actually, when you when it's just one person, it doesn't take as long for the tank to refuel. Like if you're playing four player, it takes so long. But anyway, uh, you might have to like jump off to get him. But, uh, actually, I almost did not get on the tank for some reason. It wasn't letting me on, but I managed to somehow clutch it. I don't even know how I clutched it. See, like trying to get on, and I was pretty mad. I was like already accepting that it wasn't on, and then I just boom right on it. So that's how I did it. Now here, you either have to have stamina up. Or you have to be carrying a handgun, like a pistol, because you're trying. You're gonna try to catch the tank. So grab that with haste and drop down. Start running. I managed to catch it, and I was like, no way. It would be so funny if I were to miss the lightning round. Like that'd be so funny. Like if you did all that and then you missed it. I mean, like that would be so funny. But and so at that moment, I was like. What just happened? I think my game, like, froze, and King Cacti, like, hacked my system. I was, like, sitting there, and I was like, okay, did that actually just happen? Or did my game freeze, and suddenly I was on YouTube watching a King Cacti clip? Oh, God! Alright, wait, wait, I don't know why I did that. Like, if you look at the jump, like, look at this jump. I was in the worst position. I don't even know why I was there. Look. See, there's the tread. I like hit the tread as I was jumping. If you jump, the tread might actually somehow hit your feet. It's like a it's like a creepy crawl. It doesn't make any sense, but uh, I think that's what happened. But anyway, you have to go right up there, and I'll show you. I'll just show you how to get. It. So th so once you get that piece, uh, I end up showing you. Okay, I'll just get that later. So now you have all the parts for the uh, fire staff. You go down here. So let me just back up for you. Right. So you're just getting into no man's land. You turn left. Go past the excavation site. And instead of going to Gen 4, you turn left again. And you go down here, drop down to the right. And then walk over here and it's actually the the door to generator one. You just go into this tunnel. This is the fire tunnel. So just wait for it to open. Uh, yeah, for some reason, it's really bad recording this. Anyway, just wait for the teleporter to open up, uh, access the teleporter as soon as you get in there. Run, go grab the, uh, the gym, wait for it to, uh, get going. And actually, when I was here, I decided to do the one staff first, uh, part of the upgrade. And I actually never finished, so. But anyway, so this is the column. The column that is pointing away. It is this column I'm looking at right now. It's pointing away from the teleporter. So there's the one going to the teleporter and the two uh, left and right. It's this one. See this one right here. This one right here that's pointing away. It is this one right here. Uh, so I'm actually going to show you what the finished result is. And actually, let me show you something really funny. Right here literally one shot away boom, somehow hits the zombie I have no idea how but anyway, uh, I'll have to time it perfectly uh, I am all right so that's the fi final result so I'll go and ca uh, King Cacti and I turn two little sticks two L's a tiny little dot and King Cacti and I call this the crazy L it's like an unfinished E or an L with an extra stick going to the right plus a little dot. I mean, it's really it's a triangle. It's crazy L dot. That that's the finished result. It's the two sticks, the two L, the dot, and then the L crazy L dot. So anyway, I'm trying to get out of there because the round is starting it back. Uh, I run away. Pretty sure the Panzer's on me. But anyway, this is actually. Uh, when the game ended, because I, I think I, I beat the Easter egg with King Cacti. I was gonna make a video, but like apparently it wasn't in my theater because the game was too long. I think if your if your video if your game is too long, then I want to hear the theater. So that's. What I'm doing. Anyway, we had like two Panzers, but this is how you get to the lightning. This is the lightning tunnel right here. 
So as you saw, I showed you how to get two of the parts, and then I showed you where the third part was that I ended up not getting. So go to this tunnel, make sure you have the purple disc, the 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 the, the purple record, lightning staff record that I did not communicate to you well. Make sure you have that and the gramophone. Put the gramophone there, go through there, and pick up the light. That way, if you have all three parts, then you have the gym as well, and you can build it. And I showed you how to get all the fire staff parts. I did not uh, end up building it, but if you go down to the excavation site, you can build the fire staff with all the parts I had, as you can see. But with the lightning staff, you'll just have to do all that that I did not show you, and then go down to the excavation site and build it. So anyway, guys, oh man, I'm out of breath right now. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did find this video useful, please like the video and comment telling me that it was useful and, like, you know, thank me, you know. Uh, lit speakeasy. Speakeasy, yes. Uh, if you did not even use this but you found it useful, please leave a like and all. And RC-11140 fix signing off.